Welcome back. Mason Dotson from Allen East has overcome a lot to get back in the starting lineup. And on this week's prep profile, Patrick Hamler sat down with him. And It's no small feat to start on a high school varsity basketball team. But for Allen East junior Mason Dotson, the road back into the starting five has been longer than most. For some of the chemo drugs, the, um, my lungs got really tired from it and it was made it hard to breathe. I couldn't really go as hard as I wanted to. And I got really frustrated at times because I couldn't do what I wanted to. I know what I want to do on the court and I couldn't really go all out. Dotson has spent this basketball season battling cancer, a cancer that has spread to various parts of his body. But the prognosis is good, the cancer all but gone from his 6-1 frame. Once Dotson saw the task that lay before him, he dug in. I just saw it as something else I had to do. No, I wasn't mad or anything. I just kind of went through it day by day. Scared at some times, but then if you're on a basketball court, you kind of forget about the other things around you, so I just helped being here. Even in this challenging time, Dotson has set the example for others. Actually, probably more positive than he was before he was diagnosed. He would come into practice every day when he walks in. Hey, coach, how are you doing? Always smiling at everybody, asking everybody how they're doing. But um, he's probably been, had more of an influence on us than we've had on him. While he got his first start of the season this past Tuesday against Ridgemont, he's been on the floor in some way all season. Where we could play him two, three minutes at a time, and, and he was he was hitting about two threes a game in his two or three minutes that he played. So I mean, he, he's definitely contributed to the team. He's been a big help. Dotson has had plenty of support, not just from his family, but from his teammates and those in the stands on game night. But this community's been great, and they always are. Every time something like this happens, everybody pulls together and always really supportive. So that's been good to see. It just it makes you realize how blessed you are to have people around you that pray for you. I've had people come to my house and just say, can I pray with you? And it's just, it's a good feeling. 